Twinkle. Twinkle. Good morning. Cock a doodle doo. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. JJ has never had the bakeys. M -m Maybe JJ could try some. Looks like human pieces. So, so maybe the other me will like it too. Oh, Twinkle, are you okay? Uh, you you started doing a shake and went blue like a boobery. And uh, when JJ mentioned the other me, are you okay? Is is Twinkle sure? Hmm. Wouldn't do a hecking fibby to JJ, would Twinkle? If Twinkle is sick, then Twinkle should stay in bed and drink the moodison. M medicine yes. If the moodison is, is, is moodison, like potions. JJ doesn't trust potions. You know poo poo can ever make anyone feel better. Only stinkies, yeah. The war Lukes would make JJ drink all the potions at JJ's old home. Didn't taste like poo, but still rather poopy. JJ never asked what they did, but, but it made JJ's tummy hurt. It was never nice. JJ doesn't want Twinkle to drink the moodison. Is moodison made from cows? That must be it! JJ's never had cows before, but it goes moodison. If it got the potions, don't think it'll make Twinkle better. Twinkle is okay. Promise. Oh, okay. Top of the morning, you two. Come on, let's be having you washed, changed, and downstairs for breakfast in 15. Got to open the cafe in an hour. Coming, Miss Patricia. Twinkle, you sure Twinkle will be okay? Making JJ do a hecking concern... You just need the foodsies. Oh, okay. Let's go get the foodsies. Do you loves want bacon, pancakes, or blueberry waffles? Human pieces, please, Miss Pooch Wisha. What was that? Don't be going cannibalistic on me now, boy. Oh, sorry. JJ meant the bacons because it is very samey to human skinsies. That. Is a disturbing comparison, but an educated one off one. <laughs> Bacon it is then, boy. But hurry up, or it'll get cold. <laughs> Let's go, Twinkle! The bacon was so yummy. It's the human parts that the other me eats taste like the bacons. Then JJ understands now why he didn't like his shares. Twinkle, are you okay? You did the shakies again and looking pale like a sleepsies forever person. Please don't go sleepies forever. Twinkle is fine. Hmm. Hmm. Twinkle didn't have any of the bacons this morning. An oopitite is crucial to a pooperous day. Poop-poop-prosperous day, yes. Not hungry? Hmm. Twinkle definitely having issues. But JJ won't pry because it is rude. JJ is not rude, but JJ is worried. Please talk to JJ if Twinkle needs help. Ooh, Twinkle? Who's Miss Patricia on your phone to? She got a big smile on face. Like talking to old friend. Twinkle is JJ's oldest and best friend. Patricia's second best. Not second best. Me, me, but it's really special. But Twinkle is the bestest. Yes. Oh, I would love another batch of that moonbeam coffee, please, love. It went down a treat last time we stocked it. Your kind especially loved it. Could not get enough of the stuff. You didn't have to do any funny business to get it, did you? You know I don't condone that sort of behaviour. You own the means of production now, you say. Now, you didn't have to do anything bad to acquire such means, did you? Hmm... <laughs> 
I'm never convinced with that tone, young man. It's been the same ever since you were a wee nipper. When will you swing by the cafe? Not so easy anymore. I know you're a busy man, but you'll always be that polite young man to me. Oh, you got to go, eh? Busy night planned. Well, you and that young lady of yours stay safe. Oh! How do I know you have a young lady? Oh, I've heard about it through the grapevine. <laughs> I would love to meet her. And you know an old girl like me has her intuitions. Oh, don't you get flustered now, boy. You go have a safe night. Okay, dear? Come by any time. All right, you two, twinkle love. Even this old girl can tell something is on your mind. Privacy is a young lady's prerogative, but hanging around here moping all day isn't going to help any soul. The Traveller's Fair is still going on this weekend. It's set up at the north side of Richmond Park. Great fun for all you supernatural lot. Most of the travelling lot are mythical. JJ might make some new friends. Go on now, I insist. Don't you worry. It's a quiet night here because everyone's out having fun. What was that, Twinkle Dear? Oh, you have a bad feeling about tonight. <laughs> oh, don't you worry about this old girl. No one would think to come and cause trouble here. Not only would they get a rolling pin round their bottoms, but there's a reason I would like this place ordained neutral territory. Come closer, dear. Our little cafe is favoured. By some rather powerful people. Who? Eh? Well, love, privacy is an old girl's prerogative, too. Now, <laughs> run along, loves. Look out for each other and don't talk to the really strange strangers. <laughs> But makes JJ want to do the zoomsies. <laughs> Twinkle like it here. Yay! Twinkle looks a little happier now. Twinkle, 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 Twinkle. What is? Uh, Yula Kusta. What do? You sit on it and it goes super whoosh. Can, can, can we go, please? Please, please. Want to go? Want to go? Want to go? I want to go on it. Yes, yes. Yay! Does Twink, does Twinkle like the roller coaster too? Let's go! We were like a Superman going zoom in the sky. That was so fun. Twinkle is laughing too. Yay! Oh, Twinkle, what this? Smells nummy. Shoot, dug, stand. Hmm. Doesn't look like a duke. It's meat. <gasps> meat of the man doggies. Humans eating man doggies. Oh, wow! I thought man doggies ate the humans, and the other me eats the man doggies. Like the other me did before. Not tasty. And quite sad. JJ remembers feeling really, really sad afterwards. But JJ can't remember the man doggie. But feels sad thinking about it. Straight. And not tasty. Do not eat the man doggie, Dog Twinkle! Twinkle won't like to taste the man doggy. Not, not really doggy meat. Should try? 
Hmm, okay. But JJ sus. Hello, Mr. Man. One, two, two for Twinkle. Two man doggies, please. Thank you. Oh, wow. Tastes so nice. Hot man doggy might just be JJ's favorite nummies yet. Oh, Twinkle. JJ's hot doggy just squirties down JJ's face. It's all red. JJ's shirt is covered in red. Not the usual red that JJ's used to. JJ, JJ did wonder. Tastes much different. Tomato cute soup. JJ doesn't want to eat toesies. Strange tasting part. Yeah, didn't he eat that after the other me had eaten the bodies, had eaten the other body parts? Tomato is a fruit. Tomato fruits make tasty red. No, don't clean it off of JJ. JJ likes the red. Look, Twinkle, another Lula Custa. Can go on? No. Why not? Because JJ's just eaten. Might throw up. What this? When the tummy throws the food out. Well, that sounds silly. Why well, go for all the effort to kill and eat the nummies and if going to throw out again? Wasting of the tasties. Oh, oh. A other me would never do this. Twinkle. 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 You look like you're about to throw up the nummies when I said other me again. What did the other me do? JJ. Maybe young and brain and heart. But JJ isn't silly, Twinkle. JJ feels when the other me is around. JJ cannot explain. But it is like a worm crawling around in the brain. It doesn't hurt, but it's there, slithering and shaking. The other me came to you in your sleepies and said he will eat you if you don't let him out to play. Because this was the contract made in order to save JJ. I'm sorry, Twinkle. Not JJ's fault. But if JJ stayed sleepy forever, then other me would be trapped inside JJ and couldn't hurt Twinkle. Hmm. Twinkle would take the risk just to have JJ around. Because Twinkle and JJ are bestest friends. JJ agrees! But Twinkle... If the other me ever becomes a threat to Twinkle, JJ would make himself go to sleep forever again. Must never hurt Twinkle. JJ was super serial when saying this before. Twinkle would be sad, but Twinkle would be alive. So even if sleeping forever, JJ would be at the peace. No have worry. But then the other me best be on best behavior. Oh, Twinkle! What this? Someone is hitting something over there. We go look. Ho, ho, ho. What this? This right here, young man. It's Whack-A-Mole. Whacker, whacker, what? Whack-A-Mole, boy. You take his hammer and you whack as many moles as you can as they pop up. Care to try? Oh, um, um, well, JJ shouldn't do the violence. Hitting little cute moseys is as as they pop out of the who to say hello. Not nice. No. Well, that right there's a shame. Could have won yourself a prize. <gasps> twinkle, 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 twinkle. What that? It's so big and fluffy and red. This right here's a top prize. A giant red panda plushie. Such fluffy, much red. Well, that's a shame. Big strong boy like you yourself may have had a chance to win if you gave it a try. Just need a bit of mad enough to get the top score. <laughs> please, Mr. Man, please, Twinkle. Oh, want to try now? 
Well, that'll be fifteen pound. Fifteen? Um, this is more than ten, if Daddy remembers correctly. Daddy remembers this from the counties at the store when JJ became the only of a twist. Too much for JJ. Hmm? Twinkle will pay? Too much, Twinkle! Twinkle really wants JJ to have the root pounder. Oh, OK. Thank you. JJ will do the bestest. Thank you very much, miss. <laughs> boopity boopity boop boop. How did I do? Oh, that's a shame. You didn't hit him anywhere near hard enough. What a shame. Hmm. JJ swears JJ hit fat. Harder than the last person. But they has got higher score. That's just the way of the game, son. Tell you what, I'll let you go one more time. Hmm. Die, 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 Mosey! Splatter, 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 splatter! <laughs> How did I do? Did JJ do well? Do well? You destroyed my stall! But the score is highest. So I'll take the giant red fluffy now, please. You owe me a stall. What was that, young lady? I fixed the game. I did no such thing. Watch your tongue before I slap you. No one threatens Twinkle. Did they will take the red fluffy panda now, Mr. Man, and say the sobbies, please. Or maybe JJ will play whacker, Mr. Man. Uh, real sorry, miss. Here, take your prize, boy. Congratulations. Oh, so big and red and fluffy! And fluffy and red and red and fluffy! JJ, JJ loves him! Thank you so much, Twinkle! Hmm? Get to name him? Oh, c- 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 can we call him Advu? So for Mr. Advocate. Mr. Advocate protected Twinkle! So maybe Advu will do the same. Ad voo voo! JJ is saying JJ is having a great time! Twinkle is having fun too! Yay! What what would Twinkle like to do now? Oh wow! Look, Twinkle! The sky is so clear tonight! You can see so many stars and look at this! It's a big circle! It's glowing! Yeah, full moon! It's so pretty and glowy, makes JJ feel happy. JJ wants to go for a walk in the park and stargaze. Please, you, you said, Twinkle said we could go look at the stars properly when JJ was covered in red and doing this sleep forever. No, JJ's not sleep forever. Let's go see the stars. Please, please. Yay! Thank you. Let's go, go. Now we can finally go. Let's go, Twinkle, and and add you stargazing mode activate. <laughs> oh wow! The stars really are pretty. This part of the city is so peaceful. Oh, sorry, Twinkle. The city, not city. Everyone is having the fun at the, at the theme park, so we have a nice, quiet place here. Twinkle, what is plan? Well, JJ loves it at the cafe, but JJ is having a feeling that is not forever. Twinkle is very intelligent. What did Twinkle do before meeting JJ? An activist. What is... Twinkle doesn't seem to have eight arms like Octopus. Act, not Octavist. Act Evist. What is? Twinkle fought. <gasps> oh, Twinkle fought for all the races to be accepted. But not everyone wants this. That sounds mean. Different races may taste different. But, but all have feelings, yes? So if all the races feel the pains and the sadness and the hoopies, even the zoomies, all feel these, they all should be treated the same. Being sad isn't nice, so no one should feel the sads. Doesn't matter how they taste. If someone doesn't like feeling sad, then why should they make someone else feel sad without the reasons? 
JJ doesn't like making people scared. But the other me is different. Not of this world as Twinkle knows. But Twinkle, there are people on this world that likes to hurt people too. And this is why Twinkle is an activist. Oh, okay. Twinkle really is so nice. So, if Twinkle go back to doing this someday, maybe JJ can help too. JJ would like to help. Make everyone feel happy and safe and know that JJ may look scary. But JJ's nice too. Well, uh, well, Twinkle let JJ help. Yay! Thank you! Oh, Twinkle? Does... Twinkle hear that? The music? It sounds like... Hmm... Uh, like a rave? What is? Where people do... do the dancing? Oh, like... Do, 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 do. JJ likes doing this! Can we go? <laughs> oh... Hmm... Twinkle? JJ doesn't like this! Think we shouldn't walk further. Think we should not walk further into the park. Should stay away from the music. JJ just has a really bad feeling about this. Please trust JJ. You can go home now, please. Oh no! Twinkle, look! <laughs> Man doggies! Lots of man doggies! Twinkle, these aren't soft and cuddly like Adu! <coughs> Hello, Mr. Man doggies! What doing? JJ would be really appreciative if man doggies did not look at Twinkle with the hungry look in the eyes. Twinkle is not nummies for the man doggies! <coughs> no! No, man doggy! Can't hurt Twinkle! <coughs> Don't worry, Twinkle. JJ's okay. Just a bit red. <sighs> it's okay, Twinkle. Must not hurt Twinkle. JJ is okay. Just a bit red. A big bit of red. Mandoggy claws is sharp. Twinkle. I think the man doggies are going to eat our pots. <laughs> JJ thinks now is a really good time for JJ to be the soup man and save the twinkle. Yeah, that is.
What is wrong, little werewolves? It's almost like you have seen a predator more dangerous than you. Well, we have waited long enough. The siren has finally upheld her end of the agreement. You can live for now. Little Siren. Now it is time to feed on the chaos. Werewolves. Hold on for as long as you can. Fight until your flesh tears. Fight even when your bones snap and crack. Let me dance to the melodies of your howls of agony and despair. Oh, wow! JJ did the sleepies for a moment. Oh, Twinkle, Twinkle, you, you, you okay? No bites, these are scratches on you, and JJ's arm no longer makes you red. But covered in so much red. Red and man doggy parts everywhere. The other me killed all the man doggies. P please don't do this sad, Twinkle. The man doggies were going to eat Twinkle. Chitty could not allow this. Other me was needed. But Twinkle, we need to go. Daddy has really, really bad feeling that something much worse has smelt us and is coming. It senses the other me, and, but JJ can't sense where, where it come from. And JJ senses something even worse than that. Twinkle, there's lots of nasties on the way. Twinkle, come on, let's go. Hazoo, Hazoo, Hazoo. Oh, there he is. Yes, covered in even more red, but safe. Twinkle, Twinkle, we need to leave. Run away from the music. Come on, Twinkle. 